Good evening. They're known as man's best friend and Calgary police call them their most dependable allies. Now a police dog from the canine unit is recovering from multiple stab wounds to the head after a daring attempt to stop a break and enter. Camille Carmali has more. His name is Jester, a German Shepherd from the Netherlands and a canine unit service dog for five years, specializing in drug detection, now recovering from multiple stab wounds to the head. The canines are, are essentially our, our partners, so um, you know, his partner got stabbed. Uh, the canine handler I know quite well, and uh, he's, he's taking it pretty hard. Police say at around 2 in the morning, two young males broke into this elementary school in the northeast. The canine unit was immediately called in. That's when the two suspects decided to flee on foot. Jester was able to catch up to one of them and bit him. The young man then brought out a knife and stabbed the German Shepherd in the head multiple times, sending him to the vet in life-threatening condition. He is... Uh currently been upgraded to stable. He's up walking around and he's he's back with uh, with his owner. Police say both suspects are under 18 and will be charged with break and enter. You got the odd crew come through here and they uh, cause problems. One of them is facing charges of injuring a police animal, part of new measures called Quanto's Law that came into effect in 2015 after an Edmonton police dog named Quanto was fatally stabbed. The maximum penalty is five years in jail. Meanwhile, Calgary police officers hope their most loyal partner on the beat doesn't miss a beat. And just like any uh, member of our police service, we're, we're hopeful that he returns to, to full duty. Camille Karamali, CTV News, Calgary. The young man who stabbed Jester suffered minor injuries from the bite. Police say they are investigating the motive behind the break and enter.